What's up, guys? ZachTech12 here, and welcome back to the Shadow Runner. <sighs> Last episode, we completed um, one of the harder puzzles by um, a walkthrough, but now that I'm pretty sure I know every trick in the book from watching the walkthrough again, I think I might be able to do this. I technically watched up to here. Okay. So, yeah. This teaches us how to use two shadows. So, the first one, we go over here. It waits. Now I step on here and wait till that ends so I can get the most out of the time. I kind of wish it was in the little a little scoreboard so I could see it anywhere. So activate this one. Shadows can go through the- Oh, great! Okay. Yeah! There we go! So I'm technically still in this chamber because I actually already completed that one because I tried to record this before. Now it's disappeared. So this chamber is a bit dumb. So basically, of course, I'm gonna have to get a block from here. But since shadows can't go through green barriers and the block can't go through this barrier, I'm basically trapped to this. I learned from the walkthrough that shadows can actually grab blocks from other shadows. So basically, I'm going to use that to my advantage to get a block over there. So basically, I'm gonna use the first shadow to grab this. Then I'm gonna wait a while, then use the second shadow to grab that. And then I'm while the second shadow is st still being recorded, I place it down there. And then when I when the shadows are done, I pick it up, I place it down there. Since you know the shadow itself can't go through there, and plus I'm pretty sure. Um, and also, huh. hold on a second, I've got to make sure I'm not dumb. Well, I'm not, I'm not going to say it, just, just, okay, so. That makes the block get destroyed. Can a block be destroyed when it... <sighs> so, a block can be destroyed... Can a block be destroyed while in someone's hands? I'm gonna test that theory. Can a block be destroyed while it's in a shadow's hand? Let me see. Okay, there we go. Okay, when I see it get picked up. Okay. Yes, it gets destroyed while in a shadow's hands. So that's a problem I need to figure out how to overcome. So this e deactivates that, and the slash combined with this deactivates that, which I, oh, little penguin easter egg. This is confusing. Um. This is dumb. This is dumb. 
This is just dumb. This is dumb, dumb, dummity, dumb, dumb. I'm trying to figure it out. I, I got something going. After the block is placed there, I'm able to reach the square. But there's... Um, I'm able to reach the square, and if I press the slash, a block will come down from there. Which I can... Oh! But how am I going to escape from here since this and this activate it? Uh, do I have to do something? Uh, no, I cannot jump over it. I'm going to need to find a way around it. This is stuff. I'm I'm trying to think of solutions in my head, and so the main problem is this pressure plate that respawns it, which will delete it from this area and bring it back over there, thus dropping it down here, so the shadow can't pick it up again. But to be But to be able to leave this area... This doesn't make any sense. As you can see, that just opens the door since this is not allowed to be pressed. I am so confused. Like... So the block is limited to this side. The shadows are limited to here. That's something I gotta learn to take advantage of. Somehow. I know how to take advantage of that, but my main problem is, how do I escape from this? Not knowing how to escape from it is becoming quite a problem. What is this block anyway? Quartz pillar. I'm pretty sure the other is a purple pillar. Yep, it's a purple pillar. What is it when it's deactivated? I can't really see that until I actually figure out the puzzle. <sighs> this is, this is, this is demeaning. <sighs> this doesn't make any sense. I'm, uh... I'm just at completely lost, like... Um... See, I figured out what I'm supposed to do. The basic idea of what I'm supposed to do, mostly because of the walkthrough. But getting out of here is my big problem, and I... What if I record a shadow? Oh! Never mind, I cannot make the shadow go over there. I forgot, I can the shadow cannot go over there. Oh, I just realized that it's like this! And I guess the shadow would be holding that down. If I somehow managed to both activate.
I am so confused. I am legitimately, like, completely confused. I, I actually just have no clue.